Hey everyone, this is Tim from Your Sex Tech. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to scan for your cable and your antenna channels on your LG TV. So what we want to do is go up to the top and go to settings right here and click this. Then let's go to settings here and click it. And then wait for the settings menu to appear on the left. And let's go to general now. And go on down to channels. And click it. Then we can go to channel tuning right here. And we'll have two different options to tune it. We got auto tuning or manual tuning. Uh, you can tune and save channels manually. Otherwise, just automatically do it on the top. So I'm going to go to the top. And then it's going to show you how to plug it in. And then we can go to start. And it's going through all the different channels now to see if we have them. So I'm going to go to view details. And it's going to show you the antenna down here. And then it's going to go through all the different cable TV channels down here. So cable DTV and cable TV. So this process should take about maybe like five minutes total. As you can see, it goes quite quickly, but we got to go through four of them right here. So we're going to go through this entire list to hundred percent. And I only have nine channels found under there. I thought I would have had more. So on my other TV for some reason, I get a lot more channels. let me tell you, I get about 37 air channels with my antenna hooked up and I just have it in front of the window right now. So I should be getting a lot more. Now it's going through all the different cable channels. So if you got this hooked up, um, you're going to be able to show those on here. It looks like there's quite a bit of channels. So I'm not doing really great for getting channels. So I'll have to try a couple different positions with my antenna I have, but on my other TV, it seems like it works flawlessly. And this one is just giving me some issues for some reason. So I might try out my other antenna as well. So we can go to view tips down here and look at any kind of tips they give us. And then we can go to skip. If we don't want to go through all these different cable channels, we can just skip down here and it should bypass it. And then we don't have to go through the cable channels if we're going through the antenna setup on the top. So let me know your experience with this down below. I should be getting a lot more channels, but we got all these different LG channels too. We can go through those. So we can go to done now and we can load into here and then we can see any kind of channels. Now um, to bring this up to view the live channels, uh, we want to go to the input or the HMI sources or whatever. Uh, so there's a little button on the remote. I'm just going to press this and we can see at the bottom, we just need to go to live TV antenna slash cable. So we can go to here and it should open up my live TV channels here instead of the LG channels. So it says we'll be right back. So here it is. I just went up on the remote and it looks like, who is this? The price is right. It's on or something like that. Uh, paternity court. Oh gosh. So hopefully this quick little video did indeed help you out. If it did leave it a big thumbs up and subscribe my channel down below for more tech videos coming up next on your six tech.